the Napoli starting 11. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely. That takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organisation, force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, if you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. Uh, Liverpool, the record winners of the European Cup of Champions League amongst English sides. And it's always something magical when they take part in this competition. Well, there's such rich history at this football club. Right through the players, the staff, but even more so with the spectators. They expect Liverpool to go deep in this competition. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting eleven. Joel Matty plays alongside Virgil van Dijk in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And leading the attack today is the ultimate pressing machine, Roberto Firmino. Now, what can Liverpool do with this advantageous situation? Raul Albiol gets in the way. Clattered away. Sadio Mane now. Oh, he fancies... Oh, that is a goal from long range. He won't soon forget. Absolutely right out of the top drawer. Well, let's have a look at it again. He catches the keeper asleep, back on his heels. He wasn't expecting a shot from that distance, and neither was I. A chance to revisit the goal. An abundance of space. Angled towards Insigne. It lacked conviction, that clearance. And maybe an opportunity for the opposition. Corner given. Ball retention has to be a little bit better in the second half if they're going to dominate. Possession could be key. And it might be. Blocked by Raul Albiol. Will it come back to haunt them? A golden opportunity squandered, Lee. What a chance. That was the game right there. Fabinho now. Roberto Firmino. Naby Keita. And going through Mane. Is it going to be Firmino? Just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Roberto Firmino. Well, great read there to intercept. And in with a real chance. Only the keeper to beat. And Sadio Mane finishes with a plum. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? And that is the end of the game. Three vital points picked up after that initial reverse lead. Well, yeah, back on track. That's what they are. There was no real panic after losing the first game, but they did need three points tonight. Now they can push on for the three points in game three and really put the pressure on.